Zer is currently in the Winding Cove in the EDZ, and he's currently selling <laughs> Merciless again. Uh, I've already talked about this weapon. It's really good. Uh, basically, each each consecutive shot they use with with Merciless uh, gets faster and faster. So non-lethal hits with projectiles make this weapon charge faster until it fields its wielder gets a kill. And reloading immediately after a kill increases weapon damage for a short duration. Or so, that's pretty cool. If you guys don't have it, obviously pick it up. If you guys have it, then uh, you don't even have to, have to look at it. For hunters, we have Shinobu's Val, which is it's not my favorite exotic. Improves skip grenade, and you gain an additional skip grenade charge. Skip grenades return energy when it damages enemies. Uh, you know, I'm not gonna lie. This is pretty good uh stats on this i mean you'll have a 17 17 if you give it give it mobility obviously you have 17 plus 17 uh resilience plus 10 that's pretty good this is like stacked honestly you definitely need to pick this up then like because if you master work this then it's a 19 19 that's pretty good i mean oh dude this is you know uh, there we go uh for titans you got warm god caress the exotic that usually gets fucking uh sunset each seasons because you know it not sunset it takes it gets put it gets taken away from you because it gets there's always something broken about it melee kills increase melee damage for a short period of time additional kills extend duration and increase effects this is really good um holy fuck the stats are really good 20 and 23 what the fuck oh my god pick this up what the fuck uh damn i would i don't even know what i would use on this i uh, definitely not strength um Maybe healing? No, resilience. Look at that. Dude, this is good. 21, 20, 23. Uh, maybe intellect, I would probably put it. This isn't even a PvP, like exotics. Mostly PvE, uh, most of the time. This is really good. What the fuck, bro? All right. Uh, Apothesis Veil. I'm not the biggest fan of this one. Immediately regenerate health, melee grenade, and rift energy upon activating your super. Nearby allies recharge class abilities faster. Fuck, what the fuck? Recovery 23, Discipline 23, Intellect 12? I mean, like, it's not, it's not. Bro, the fact that you get 23 on recovery already is like, you can use literally this on anything. So if you want higher grenade, obviously Discipline would be super dope for a 23-23. Uh, you can use it on an Intellect for a 23-22. Bro, I, I hate this exotic, but I probably would scoop this. Like, it's just, I don't know where, like when I would, think about using this I, I would probably maybe use this with uh with stasis maybe i don't know but that's pretty cool i guess for the weapons we have seven serif auto loading and vorpal that's pretty good i'm i guess i'm not a big fan of vorpal on primaries unless the primary does a fuck ton of damage already uh mass perdition under pressure and kill clip okay okay that's pretty good uh whispering slab killing win and swashbuckler that's pretty good i would say it's a it's pretty good pve uh weapon right there pvp as well uh timeline timelines vertex uh shield disorient and elemental capacitor that's, that's all right i'm not a big fan of that but pve maybe main ingredient moving target backup plan backup plans garbage to so know uh, outrageous fortune snapshot sites and rampage no Crowd Pleaser, Killing Wind, and Quick Draw, no. And for the armor, we have Simulator. We have the Simulator ar armor, which is the Future War Cult armor, which is pretty cool that they're giving. These arms are bad. Uh, these arms, I mean, everything besides the mobility is pretty good. No, and no. So that's pretty much it. Uh, let's see what I get for my weekly exotic. Celestial. You give me can you give me a good celestial no i mean oh look at that intellect though me mm, i don't i just don't like having 16 16 this one's 14 18 five master over 18 18 we'll see but that's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Uh, from weapons, I think uh, Last Perdition, Whispering Slab. Uh, I'm thinking about like maybe this one would be a good one for uh, for PVE. <clears throat> um, void. So yeah, this probably would be a good PVE one. Just uh, use Void so you can stack that uh, that stability. 
yeah, I think that'd be pretty cool. Uh, main ingredient looks really bad compared to last week's, and then these two, no. Armor looks pretty cool. If you guys don't have this armor, I highly suggest you pick it up. It looks really cool. And other than that, I will see you guys later.